What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming, bringing you guys your weekly Destiny Trials strategy video. Thank you so much for tuning in. For those of you that are new, we do this every single week, baby, along with a bunch of other videos. Last video we announced we're going to start doing small giveaways on each of our videos. Last video's giveaway winner has already been direct messaged. For this video, we're giving away $20 PSN card. For those of you that want to enter, all you have to do is like the video and comment anything down below regarding Destiny at the end of that comment comment just put hashtag destiny the winner will be direct message the way you know is you are subscribed to the channel so make sure you do that now let's get into this video burning shrine a classic classic trials of osiris map i'm going to quickly get into why i'm using a hand cannon and a shotgun well first off the hand cannon i'm using is a eyes luna finally got one to drop horrible drops it does have rifle barrel and sure shot as the sight but honestly the two perks are luck in the chamber and triple tap which in the sweat game communities it's just not two good perks but overall not a bad gun if i didn't have anything else to use my palindrome is still a little bit better anyways so let's get into why i'm using this well this map is not too big of a map now it does have many lanes for snipers to use a sniper rifle but you also want to keep in mind that you don't want to have all three of your team members running a sniper rifle you want to make sure you have one at most two but i still recommend only one good sniper on your team the other two should be running a shotgun you can pair that shotgun up with a Pulse Rifle like Clever Dragon, as you guys know, a great Pulse Rifle. Grasp of Malik is good. Blind Perdition is also another good one. The reason why I say that is those pulses will help to counter against snipers just camping lanes, but also the shotguns will then, once your sniper gets a drop on a kill, then you can just hound the last two guys with your shotgunners, or let's say there's one person left on the other team, your shotgunners can hound that individual. Now, obviously you guys see that we have Sunside spawn. Some teams will actually camp Sunside because it's just the advantage side. You know, you can just grab your sniper rifle and just camp lanes. It's not a bad strategy, to be honest. However, if you are faced with campers, just be patient. You know, we've played a lot of Trials of Osiris games. As you guys know, on stream, we carry people left and right all weekend long. Please do tune in if you want help to get carried. The link is in the description below. But we don't run into too many campers. But when we do, you just got to play patient. Now, if you have a good sniper, your sniper can get those picks. But let's say you don't have a sniper. Just hold the middle of the map. Don't poke those lanes. Let time expire. The flag still spawns inside. So that team still has to come inside sooner or later, right? So you got to play patient. Don't be in a hurry, guys. Remember, Trials of Osiris, you got to win all the nine games or whatever with the boon seven and once you get lighthouse that's all that matters you don't want to lose on your last game or you don't want to be going on your card without a mercy so keep in mind what we're doing is we try to have at least two people stick together throughout the map all right you want to make sure to why two because let's say you get in a gunfight and you get somebody absolute one shot for example boom perfect that teammate that i had went in died the the other guy was one shot i threw a grenade following up and it got the kill now you want to make sure you're paired up because look even in circumstances like this i was able to get the res i knew that when he shoots a rocket i may die i was hoping my overshield would tank it but he still survived because he was at in that invincibility phase when you get revived and it's just a good idea to also run those quick revive chest pieces and helmets now i know we're not doing it it's okay but if you guys want to it's not a bad idea also keep in mind is right now we know that we have supers and they don't we want to close out this game being up 4-1 on the team don't let the other team camp back and use scory and whatnot to get their supers and just own everything so i really hope these quick tips helped you guys out remember subscribe like the video and just drop any random comment down with hashtag destiny to possibly win the giveaway i love you guys so much thank you guys so much for tuning in we'll see you in the next one peace out